so guys uh, this is a high current ups transformer i got it from my old computer ups and uh, today i am going to build a high current dc power source using this transformer so the basic thing the thick wire is for the high current so this side is uh, the secondary binding and uh, high current and low voltage side and uh, this side this is the primary coil and uh, you see some ratings are written in here 0 154 185 225 273 225 volts that means uh, this side primary and uh, these are the the black wire is 0 means the black this is uh, the neutral wire this is common and uh, this is 1 154 185 and 1 2 3 5 wires are here so i'm going to check the continuity test uh, of the binding this is uh, multimeter and uh, this is in buzzer mode so let's uh, check it first The primary binding is okay. Now check the secondary binding also. The secondary binding is also good. Eleven ohm. Thirteen point three. Sixteen. 19.5 16 16 16 and 16 this one 19 and this one 13 and this one 11 okay this is the primary winding uh, coil resistance and now checking the secondary winding coil resistance 0.9 ohm 0.8 ohm 
डोंट नीड दिस वायर्स सो आई वांट टू कट इट हेयर टू ट्वेंटी वोल्ट्स होम ए सी सप्लाई आई एम यूजिंग दिस रेड वायर एज ए जम्पर केबल सेवेंटीन वोल्ट्स ए सी Now I'm changing the jumper cable in each port for various AC supply. First port uh, we get 17 volts AC and second port we get near about 13 or 14 volts AC. Once again uh, 16 volt in third port. Now in the fourth port we get 20 volts, and in the fifth port we get near about 24 volts. I am going to use this transformer as a high current 12 volt DC power supply. So I need 14 volts AC power supply from this transformer. Here in the second port we get 14 volts AC. I need this voltage. for this project this is a car headlight bulb uh, 12 volt and uh, 36 watts the connection is all set and here on the switch and you see the brightness of the bulb this is running on ac current now i'm going to check the current consumption of this bulb here the meter the meter is in 20 ampere ac mode and you see the consumption 2.6 ampere ac Now guys uh, this is a 35 ampere bridge rectifier module I am using this module to convert AC into DC You can also use this kind of diodes to make a bridge rectifier this is a 3 ampere and this one is 6 ampere diodes getting near about 10 volt dc from rectifier bridge and the ac supply is near about 12 volts yes now this is a high value capacitor i'm using this capacitor in the positive and the negative end of the uh, bridge rectifier checking the voltage again 10 volts uh, dc now guys after placing the capacitor in the bridge rectifier positive and negative end checking the voltage again and it's uh, increase near about 16 or 17 volts uh, dc uh, because of uh, this is uh, why because of this uh, charged capacitor uh, this is all suitable for your uh, 12 volt power supply uh, you can charge your battery and uh, any kind of uh, 12 volt device uh, run in this uh, voltage 
I connect the jumper cable. This black and the red cable are for the positive and the negative. And this is a car power window motor. And I am testing this motor from this 12 volt supply. See the sparking. Battery voltage is 11.6 volts. This is the load voltage uh, after connecting the battery into the circuit. You see the speed of the charging, uh, high speed because of the uh, high current. So guys, uh, if you enjoy my content, uh, you can support me by subscribing the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.